action for a speedy trial to get to the 18080 so you could be released, though? Huh? Officer, yeah. I got I gotta talk to you on the side alone in a minute. And cop talking ass niggas. They talk to the COs all day. Don't get your info from that dude, bro. You heard? There's not not a, a lot of them are smart. Don't get it twisted. But don't run off of him, cause you have your blow trial. Take your mother's commissary money. You feeding him. <laughs> That's their hustle, bro. You get it? Some of them are good, some of them are not. You're not always gonna get a blood on a razor wire. The, you know blood on a razor wire? The Blanquito that makes videos too? You're not always gonna get a good dude like blood in a razor wire that's gonna really take your case and help you in it has uh, morals, principles, and all that that you could tell he does just by looking at him. If you've been around, like, boy's a solid dude. You get it? Like, super solid. Like, they don't even make him no more like that, right? The more you study him, the more you get that, right? So not everybody's like him. Facts. But to avoid all that, just don't get locked up, you heard? And don't rob older ladies or old men. Don't rob nobody. That shit is sad. You got $60. But here's the thing. I went through that before. I learned from my experiences, bro. I put dudes in a coma. Damn near killed them. And then all you ran off with was $13, my dude. Yo, you serious? We got to do another robbery. Because I was on a robbing spree for most of my whole life. Like, robbery after robbery after robbery in one day. Like, my peoples knew that. Like, I would come home with a book bag full of shit. I'm just robbing people all day. Facts. From the morning I got up to the night. That was my life. Either you're hustling. Even when I was hustling, I caught an addiction of robbing people. I couldn't meet you without trying to figure out a way. What can I get from you Like that I could rob you for? And that's bad. So today when I get my little friends... I try to keep them, and I'm super loyal. So when people say loyalty is something that you're born with, you just can't train yourself to be that way, that's a lie. I'm super loyal. I'm, I'm the lo most loyal dude you'll ever meet in your life, right? But I wasn't always like that. So that's a lie. I'll debunk that. Pop! And you can ask anybody that know me. Read the comments. Niggas be like, yo, watch boy. Boy is grimy because they know me from the past. They don't know me from today. They haven't been around me. But the next nigga they tell that to be like, you stupid boy, solid. I'll be with boy. Boys are super. You get it? Because I became that. So don't let these dudes tell you that it's something you born with. You can't. Nah, he lying. He's trying to look good for the television. That's like dudes that were buns and pussy. You see them a year later, he could be a super thug and a killer. I seen that. I seen that. You get it? Like, let's say like a dude like... You know the dude I be saying sometimes, Bullets Gotti? Like everybody think he pussy, right? Hey, He talking, oh, he's not like that. To prove himself, one day he'll just lose his mind. Somebody will step to him and he got a gun knowing that dudes want to smack him up when they see him and all that. And he blam you out of fear and catch a body. Now dudes be like, oh, shit. Son shot him. Yeah, nigga. You thought it was something sweet. Anybody could pull a trigger. Anybody. It only takes a few things of pressure, homie. And that shit go pop. Facts. And it's going to be a super regretful decision, especially if you're not built like that. And now you're on the island. I was on the island with a dude that was the 